and the Wolfman, thank you so much for tuning into this video. So right here we have Lotta and Lacey right there. And right here we got the Willow. And here we have Luna. And right here we have Loco. And right there is Mr. Colty. So we're gonna head on out. It's going to be a great run today. Unfortunately, we don't have enough snow for the sled, but we do, of course, for the bike, which is called a paw trekker. Anyways, let's get out of here. Team at the ready, team power up. kilometers into our run here basically in the middle of nowhere if you look around really nothing anywhere so let's say we go to a worst case scenario here um, again like I'd said in a, a previous video the dogs see a deer squirrel whatever pop a tire on a bike uh, all of a sudden I'm rolling around on the ground I wreck my phone now I'm stuck here uh, and let's say something serious happens like I break a leg right and that could very well easily happen in this environment so then what well, this is why bringing and preparing for these things is so important. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you right there on the bike, you will see a, uh, a little green bag, right? You can get those bags on eBay, local surplus stores all over the place. Uh, and in it is specialized equipment. So let's, uh, let's take a look at that equipment and maybe it will help you someday if you're out in this situation and you'll think, hey, I watched this video and the guy said to be prepared and it may save your life. All right, so let's open it up here and pull everything out. So, start at this side. We have vet wrap. Vet wrap is also known as self-adhesive, um, I think it's called like latex impregnated self-adhesive bandage. Really great if you get a cut or a sprain or anything like that. Fantastic uh, equipment. I always advocate everybody having that stuff. Let's, uh, let's open it up here and go into the actual bag itself. So, this little pouch on the outside. In here, I've got a lighter. Very, very important to have a, you know, a lighter when you uh, when you're out in the woods. I've got some of these little straws. In these little straws, this is just a straw that I've heated, and there's a cotton ball packed in there. So the cotton ball will be great if I need to start a fire. All right, I got headphones in there because I like to listen to the music, and I got some tape. All right, so it's always good to have some extra. That's just electrical tape, but have some electrical tape. So. So that's that pouch. In the big pouch, we got more survivally stuff. Of course, very important, we got a knife, right? Super important, has something to cut with. We've got some paracord in here. Super bright colored paracord, specifically, so if I need to string that, whoever sees it is gonna know that it's, uh, you know, they're, they're not gonna miss that, right? Poop kit, that's just some toilet paper here in a little container, right? You never know when you need to go, right? A couple of comfort items here. Those are like these little easy paper towel things. Basically what they are is uh, like, you know, paper towels if you get your hands all wet. Uh, yeah, so that's what looks like is, is in there. So we'll zip that guy up. So again, I've got some fire starting stuff. I've got some comfort stuff. All right, more fire starting stuff. Super high visibility match box container. So you got some matches in there. Look at that color, right? Check this out. You take this, and if I drop it, or if I chuck it out into the to the distance, you're gonna find that. That's why it's that color, right? Look what else we got in here. We got one of these little survival blankets, emergency blankets made out of ni mylar, just in case I get cold or, or get stuck somewhere. And of course, my favorite, the ferro rod. Ferro rods are, have always been one of my uh, most favorite fire starting tools. They work really well in all weather conditions. So I've got three different ways to start a fire. Matches, lighter, and ferro rod. I have an emergency blanket. I've got uh, some stuff in there to uh, make a shelter with. I've got every single thing I need just in the event that I was stuck. 
So there you have it, a little bit of what I carry in my pouch. Just some very, very basic things. Most importantly, I got a knife, I got a couple of different ways to start a fire, and I got a shelter in case I'm stuck out here. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. I'm the Wolfman, and please consider subscribing.